you may have encountered the phrase, correlation does not imply causation. For instance, rain and clouds are statistically correlated. But from statistics alone, we don't know if rain causes clouds or if clouds cause rain. Statistics only tell us there is a correlation. We need more science to establish causation. Statistics can never prove causation. While you can use various mathematical tools to grade a correlation as weak or strong, all you're ever going to get is correlation. On the other hand, statistical correlations can be a powerful and informative tool. Take lung cancer, for example. At the turn of the century, lung cancer was extremely rare. But by the mid-1980s, lung cancer had become the leading cause of cancer deaths worldwide. What had changed? In short, the introduction of the manufactured cigarette. The Tobacco Institute, a lobbying group for the tobacco industry, was founded in the 1950s to cast doubt on the theory that cigarette smoking caused lung cancer. Their strategy was to repeatedly apply the correlation does not imply causation argument. If a person gets lung cancer, it is impossible to prove that tobacco smoke was the cause. The tobacco lobbyists capitalized on this limitation. However, over time, the statistical link became undeniable, culminating in 1998 with the largest civil settlement in U.S. history. The four largest cigarette manufacturers agreed to pay $206 billion to 46 states. Part of the deal was to dissolve three lobbying groups, including the Tobacco Institute.